everybody, it's Matthew, and I need to talk to you guys about some changes I need to do down here. Uh, the DWC, I am not too thrilled about. I was down here the other day just doing a routine water change, and I uh, took one of the plants out, changed out the water, put it back in, and I noticed the leaves were a little bit droopy, and I figured, ah, no big deal, it's just without water for a little bit while I was changing. But then it just never seemed to recover, so I pulled actually pulled the plant and cut it down uh, and I think I might be doing the same with the other two plants as well because they aren't looking really any better they're not growing and in this space what I'm going to do is build a new project for in there all of the seedlings and cuttings and clones were growing they need to go someplace and they can't go in the flood table behind me because these guys are on a different uh, feed program than what the clones will be on. So I'm going to take out all the DWC stuff. I'm going to build another uh, flood and drain table, a lot smaller. And this way we can grow some things in there. And I don't have to worry about them while I'm gone away at work. And yes, I am finally going back to work. I got my visa the other day, so I'm really excited. So it should be any day now I'm going back to work. So I need to set up a spot to put these plants while I'm away so they can grow. When I first bought my house, there's actually a lot of items that the previous owners left behind. And one of those things that they left was this really old, it's almost, it's probably an antique sink. And this thing, I think I can use as my uh, flood table, I guess, for this new flood and drain system I'm going to build. So it's not going to be much different than the flood table I built before and I made videos of that build as well. Uh, this one I'm just going to take a few measurements here and try to build the shelves around it and that should be it. I'm not expecting any big surprises with this one. So let's get into the garage and start building. So in my garage I have my lumber. I know about what I want to do for size and design for this one so just a matter of cutting these things down and putting them together. The sink is going to set in this piece of plywood. I've traced the outside of the sink and then I took it in just over an inch to make up for the lip that's on the sink. So I'll take a jigsaw and cut this out and then I'll be one step closer to completing this thing. There we go. That's probably all I want to be doing for outside right now. It's pretty cold, so I think I can manage the rest inside and we'll get everything else put together. That looks like it might actually work. So I'm going to put it in the corner where the DWC stuff used to be and get this thing a little bit more ready. So that's about all the work I'm going to be doing on this thing today. Uh, next episode we'll work more on the plumbing and lighting and getting it ready for the plants. Thanks for watching.